How do you smoke a turkey on a charcoal grill? In this video, I'm gonna show you how to set up a charcoal grill, how to prep a turkey, how to add that smoky flavor and get it cooked evenly so you get a tender, delicious, smoky turkey. This is the only video you need to learn how to smoke a turkey on a charcoal grill. So stay tuned, let's get to the video. Using your charcoal grill to smoke your holiday turkey is a great way to free up the kitchen and add some smoky flavor to the meal. But it takes a bit of prep work to ensure your turkey cooks evenly on the grill. First, brine your turkey for 24 hours in a solution of one cup of salt to one gallon of water. When you take the turkey out of the brine, dry it thoroughly and then rub some oil on it. The oil is going to help the skin get crispy and browned. Next, sprinkle on your seasoning. In this case, I'm using a basic barbecue rub with paprika, chili powder, salt, and some other ingredients. Check out the description section below this video for that rub recipe. I recommend sticking with a smaller turkey in the 10 to 14 pound range because the larger ones are much harder to cook evenly on a charcoal grill and you run the risk of undercooking parts of the turkey. After your turkey is prepped, go outside and set up your grill for indirect cooking. Push the lit coals to each side of the grill and then place an aluminum pan in the middle of it to catch the drippings. You're going to want to try to maintain the temperature at 350 degrees Fahrenheit throughout the cook. Next, place the turkey in the center of the grill, breast side up. There's some recipes out there for doing it breast side down and then flipping it halfway, but this method works just fine for me and I've always done it this way and it's always resulted in a juicy bird. Now put some pellets, wood chunks, or chips directly on the coals and leave it to cook for an hour. After an hour, put five or six fresh briquettes on each side. You can also put some more wood on depending on how smoky you want the turkey, but I find an hour of smoke is more than enough. When the lid is open, you can also hit the breast with some apple cider vinegar and water spray to keep it from drying out and getting too crispy. Monitor the temperature of the meat and continue to refresh the coals every hour on the hour. When the turkey reaches around 160 degrees to 165 degrees, then take it off the grill and rest it for 15 minutes to allow the cooking process to finish and help retain moisture. Now cut into the breast and slice it against the grain into serving portions. And that's it. I hope you guys found this video helpful and your next grilled turkey turns out great. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you can stay up to date on all my latest videos. Happy smoking!